Buccaneer, and now he has captured the world of radio. Ladies and gentlemen, my esteemed honor here to introduce to you the one and only Mr. Robert Conrad. Hey, thank you for that introduction. Now, um... Did we get our, your studio set up today? Your microphone's not in front of you? No, I didn't put it in front of me. Okay. I, know, I know how to do that. I know how to do Switches that. weren't turned. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm, uh, is that kind better? Of a rocky do, start, technically. Hey, do you like that better? I love that. That's okay, wonderful. Good. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, this theme, you know, we might want to uh, uh, integrate it with some other themes. I was driving here. Um, it was a week ago Wednesday. A week ago on Wednesday. Okay. Yes. Okay. Um, uh, obviously, uh, I was coming here to do some work prior to the Thursday show. Right, preparation for the show. Yeah, and I've been, you know, wanting to do that forever, and I never seem to get it done. But I will get it done to help uh, Courtney out. And um, and uh, I, the phone rings in the car, and um, I said hello, and this woman with a kind of teary voice said. Uh, um, hello, and I said, well, um, is it you, dear? And she said, yes, and I said, and why are we so upset? She said, well, we can have our dinner at 7.30 if you, if you wish, because uh, the uh, other persons that are involved in the project w would like to meet you. And, uh, but uh, I want to tell you now that we've just heard they're not going forward with the project. What? And I said, uh, I said, well, listen, dear, it, it's not the end of the earth. Uh, you will recover from it, and uh, not next week, but the week after, I'll call you. And I've got those pictures that you wanted for your father of the Black Sheep Squadron, and I'd like to get to meet you in person because we've been meeting each other on the telephone. And tell your your boss uh, that I look forward to meeting him, and also the other person that was involved. And that was notice that uh, CBS wasn't going forward with the television version of the Wild Wild West. So they have decided not to go forward with this TV version. And I was going to be incorporated in it. I you was were save, going to be. Well, but I wanted to save the announcement to radio, you know, and say, hey, guess what? That's the class I, act of you, yes, I, will I like be, that. I will be uh, the producer, or one of the producers of the new uh, show, and then we're going to go out and, you know, cast it, whoever was going to play it, right. Ross, and play it myself. And I was going to direct a few episodes on and on. But wow. uh, the, my reason for telling uh, that story is when things get down, you drop your chin, you raise your hand, and you just keep going. It's not the end of anything. And that theme keeps coming up. But I'm wondering, you know, um, maybe it, uh, I had, I've had other work other than <laughs> this theme. Well, it's true. And so I'm thinking maybe we can introduce me with something like maybe uh, the theme of the black sheep squadron or not we don't want to go back to hawaii and i uh that would have listeners fall off the chair and say grandma used to listen to that one i went out with her and she looks fabulous connie stevens looks fabulous yes yes she always looks fabulous well i just called her the other day and i just i said kai called you for one reason just tell you how terrific it looked congratulations Huh? Well, I'll, I'll call her and tell her that I think she looks fabulous, but I don't even yeah. see in the, seeing her because I know she is when she was on your program here. It will, we continue straight ahead, the PM Show, Robert Conrad. <laughs> 